Hello, I'm Jeff Tucker, Product Manager for the Personal Productivity Group here at GitLab. We're going to take a look at our 17.6 planning issue today. Uh, we've got three key themes for this milestone. Uh, first off, we're going to release the new view-based to-do list for uh, internal dog footings. That'll be just internal team members. Uh, next up, we're going to be finalizing designs for notification settings for to-dos. And then lastly, if we have capacity for it, we'll start into the next major features for the to-do list. Starting on the design side of things, so we're continuing to focus on notification settings this milestone. Uh, last milestone, we completed some problem validation for notification settings, and now we now have a better understanding of the key problems to address and how we want to approach them. Uh, as a brief summary, the levels mostly make sense, uh, those being the notification levels, and they're being used appropriately, uh, but there are some pain points to relying on them. People want notifications where they work. For some, that's an email, and for others, that's in GitLab. Uh, folks are very afraid of duplicate notifications, and so most people uh, have felt like they want notifications in one location or the other, but not both. Uh, so design will be focused on creating solutions to these problems during this milestone. Uh, if we have extra time beyond that, we'll start into the next major feature for the to-do list, uh, namely looking at the preview pane to give context about a notification uh, without having to leave the page. On the build track, uh, we've reached feature parity in the new view-based to-do list. So uh, that means it functionally does everything that the currently live uh, Hamel-based to-do list does. Uh, so we're gonna extend access to our internal GitLab team members to gather their initial feedback. So our first priority this milestone will be to address any issues or critical feedback that arise from this experiment. But beyond that, we'll focus on some of the major features that the new view-based page makes available for us now. Uh, features like live reloading, automatically refreshing the to-do content every so often to ensure that it's always up to date. Uh, snoozing notifications, which we've been making progress on for the last couple of milestones, uh, but we'll just look to finish the final UI bits this milestone. Um, and then potentially moving into full text search for notifications as we have time. Now the goal for this Milestone will be to collect feedback. So we do have a feedback issue here. So as you're trying out the new view-based to-do list, please pop on in here and leave your thoughts. We'll keep this updated as we introduce new features to ex explain what's changed uh, and hopefully to collate the feedback and let you know what we are still waiting to address and what we've shipped updates on. As a quick preview, here is the the, the new to-do list. Uh, you'll note that it looks pretty well exactly like the uh, original one that is very much the intent right now we are aiming for parity to ensure that the new tech work is expected and then we will go to layer on some new functionality the one thing that did change is that we have moved away from the drop down style filters to use our standard um, pajamas compliant filter ux uh, so you'll see that just like you see on the issues or merge request pages um, elsewhere in gitlab all right, so that is everything for our 17.6 release. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, any feedback, uh, please reach out. We're happy to chat.